Thank you, Madam Deputy Speaker. Well, this weekend I had a terrific weekend, just gone. Uh, last Saturday night with my wife and Leone. My wife and Leone, I mean my wife uh, and I, we attended the Pacific. <laughs> I almost got myself into trouble then, didn't I? Uh, <laughs> Uh, having said that, let me say this. Uh, we attended the Pacific Lutheran College rendition of Greece, and we had an absolutely fantastic time. Uh, 44 students, seven staff. It was, uh, we hadn't been to a, a live theatre performance in so long. We had such a good time. The quality of the students' performances were just amazing. You now, often you go to one of these school uh, musicals and there's a couple of standout kids and the rest are, uh, 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 but this one was fantastic. All the kids, they, their voices were just amazing. Great actors, great singers, and of course the staff were, uh, most of the staff did the music, music, and that was first rate as well. So a huge shout out to uh, Pacific Lutheran College for your performance of Greece. All the, uh, the staff, the, uh, the, the crew, and, uh, and the actors were just amazing, so congratulations. I also, on Sunday uh, morning, attended the Montville Tennis Club. And they've been uh, uh, open since 1925, but their numbers had dropped down to 14 members. And they were operating on some very, very old and worn uh, tennis courts. And uh, quite frankly, the club was, was really withering. But um, uh, to their great credit, they uh, amassed some $276,000, only a very, very small contribution from, I think it was the uh, local government, no, no funding from the state or the, uh, or the uh, Commonwealth. But this really excited me because it was the community that bandied together and raised this money and they built a new clubhouse, put new well, uh, courts in. Uh, Madam Deputy Speaker, when it comes to tennis, there are highs and there are lows, but there was all highs on Sunday morning. Uh, such a great community spirit. Uh, the, the club started out with just 14 members before the, the club was rejuvenated, and now they have 88 members. And such terrific spirit. I want to send a huge shout out to Wayne and Brett and the coach Ian for, and all of the management committee for getting such a terrific grassroots club off the ground and really breathing life into it. Um, I also want to give a big shout out to Chris Bond and, and, uh, and Bridie Keane, who are uh, just about to leave for Tokyo, two Paralympians. Uh, go and do us proud, Bridie and Chris, because uh, you are everything that the Sunshine Coast should be, you are everything that Australians should be. Uh, go well in Tokyo.